A very good morning to all of you. My name is Muhammad Huzaifa. Today, I am going to explain you parts of a plant. Plants can be classified in two parts. The root system and the shoot system. First comes the root system. It is located below the ground. Responsible for absorbing water and minerals from the soil. And gives support to the whole plant or tree. The root system includes organs such as roots. Next comes the shoot system. It is located above the ground and helps plants making their food by the process of photosynthesis. The shoot system includes the organs such as stem, leaves, flowers and fruits. This is the brief overview of the shoot system and the root system. Now I am going to explain the parts of a plant and its function. Let's get started. First comes root. The root is located below the ground. It helps to support the plant to the ground so it does not fall over. It absorbs water and nutrients from the soil and sends it to the stem. Do you know guys there are many kinds of roots? I am going to only explain two. Number one, taproot. A taproot is large, central and dominant root from which other roots sprout laterally. Examples of taproot, carrots, dandelions and beetroots. From the picture you can easily see one dominant root. Next comes fibrous roots. Fibrous roots are made up of many small roots, all about the same size. The small roots grow in many directions from the base of the stem. Examples of fibrous roots, grass, wheat and onion. In the picture you can easily see some small roots which are called fibrous root. This is the difference between taproot and fibrous root. The second part of the plant is stem. Stem performs an important job for the whole plant. They support the plant. Stem acts like the plant's transportation system. It receives water and minerals from the root and distributes it among all the parts. Third one is leaf. A leaf is usually green, flat structure attached to a stem. The leaf is known as a plant food factory because it prepares food for the entire plant through the process of photosynthesis. Under this process, the leaves make glucose or food using sunlight, water and carbon dioxide. Along with photosynthesis, the leaves do many other important tasks such as the loss of water vapor from the plant, helping the plant breathe, storing food, etc. Fourth one is flower. Flowers are the reproductive organs of flowering plants. It makes seeds which become new plants. Along with reproduction, flowers are also a rich source of food for other living organisms such as insects, birds, animals and humans. Fifth one is fruit. A fruit is part of flowering plant which protects the seeds by covering it. Last one is seed. A seed is the reproductive part of a plant. It is planted in the ground from which a new plant grows. Amazing guys, right? From a seed you can grow a plant. Thanks a lot everyone. I hope you enjoyed my video.